If you go through my YouTube channel, you notice that my thumbnail pictures are similar, but the colors are different. It's down old, different. And what if I told you that I took the pictures with just one outfit? Now, in this tutorial, I'm going to be teaching you how I was able to change the color of my outfit to multiple colors using PixArt. In case you're a business owner and you sell products that has multiple colors, then this tutorial is also for you because you're going to learn how you can just take one picture of your product and change the color to multiple colors. I'm also going to show you how to animate the picture and make it look as cool as this. And trust me, it's not even difficult. It's something that you can do once you follow this video step by step. Do not skip any part. Now, if this is something that you're interested in, please come closer and let's dive in. So to get started, all you have to do is to open the picture that you want to work with and then share it to PixArt. So now the picture has opened on PixArt. Next thing you're going to do is to tap on effects and then you're going to see color replace. Click on color replace and you're going to see this color wheel that you can use to replace any color and then move it around and select the darkest part. And once you do that, these three color sliders will come up. And once they come up, all you have to do is to just move your slider to any color that you want. So what I usually do is that I'll move it way to the end and then I'll hit on download and I'm good. And then I'll move it small, just a little and get this color and hit on download as well. And then I'll move it again and hit on download. Two seconds later. Now with just one picture, we've been able to achieve multiple pictures that we can use for our designs or our product sampling. So let me quickly show you how to automate it. Just in case you're a business owner, you want to showcase the different colors you have for a particular product. So to do that, you need a video editing software or app. Anyone can actually work. You don't need any fancy video editing app or software. So all you have to do first is to send it to a video editing app. For the purpose of this tutorial, I'm going to be using Ucut video editing app. It's an amazing free editing app that you can use for all this. So now that we have opened one of the picture on the editing app, the next thing we're going to do is to bring in the other pictures as well. So all I have to do now is to click on this plus sign and then I'm going to tap on the pictures, select all of them and then click on next and we'll have all the pictures here. So now that we have brought in all the pictures in the video editing app, the next thing we're going to do, as you can see, the video length is 56 minutes, which is very long. So all we have to do is to trim down all the pictures one after the other to one second. So let me show you how to do that. You just click on each of the picture and slide it down to this and do the same thing for this one, do the same thing for this one. So I'm going to go ahead and do this off screen and come back so that I don't waste your time. Two seconds later. So now I'm done and I've been able to trim down the pictures from 50 minutes to 1.4 seconds. So let me play it so that you can see how it looks. So now we have this, it's actually fast, but let me show you a trick on how to balance it. So we're going to go ahead and save this, click on save, and make sure you leave it on 1080p and high quality. You can decide to bring down the frame rate to 24 FPS, and that is all you need to do, and click on save. Now it's going to save the video. Now the next thing we're going to do is to send it back to the app again. So we'll tap on other, so we'll select you cut again and we have the video here. Now that we have the video here, what we want to do is to reduce the speed. You can achieve this by highlighting this and then you go to speed. You can do this with any app, any app or any software, just the same procedure, right? And then you bring it down to 0.2x and then you click OK. So now we have a seven second video. So if I play it now, it's going to display like this different colors, same shirt. <laughs> this is interesting. So all you have to do is to just copy and paste. So you can copy and paste it to make it longer, but it's as if it's a little bit slow. So I'm going to just go ahead and increase the speed just a bit. So now we have this amazing, right? Now the next thing you're going to do, because it's actually short, you want it to replay or on loop, all you have to do is to just copy this, click on copy, click on copy. So it's going to keep looping 
So now we have a loop. So let's assume that you have this product, this shirt in this multiple colors. You don't need to take multiple pictures. You just need to take one picture and then follow this procedure and have something like this. Guys, is this not amazing? Don't I deserve a subscription? Go ahead and subscribe to this channel so that you don't miss amazing tutorials like this. And if you want to learn another amazing digital skill that will help you make money online, I recommend that you go watch this video next and thank me later. See you in the next one. I am Seven Figure Boss. Ciao.